Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to the IMAX YouTube channel. JD here. If you're new, please do smash that like button, share, and definitely subscribe. And for the persons that's already here, keep on sharing the contents far and wide. We really and truly appreciate it. So as you know, by the title, um, we are going to be talking Tari McGee, give you a little bit of the backstory and also where he's going at this point. Obviously, you saw by the title, but we're going to break it down um, on the screen. So let me go over to the detail in screen so Tariq Maggie as you know I'm the Jamaican reggae boy um, at this point he is 23 years old and um, his contract at Cassiopeia expires June 30th all right so he's not there um, in the USL as yet all right yes so the situation with Maggie over the whole stint of him being there because he joined from 2021 July 1st he 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 struggled to get game time there and um, the heavy rotation of in and outs from Kasupin maybe cost his overall tenure there um, to be much more difficult. Obviously, you know that the Belgian Pro League from time to time could prove very, very difficult because the level from Jamaican football to the Pro League sometimes is very, very tough. And also it it comes, it combines with the ambition of the club. So if the club is a feeder club, it might you have to be very very much well groomed with the european ways to keep on rotating new bodies so it's hard for you to actually fit in not saying that was a problem for him but i'm just letting you know that that could be some type of challenges because i am here all right yes so he struggled to get game time as you could see right here he barely got games all right five percent five appearances and three minutes um and barely got good participation all right so it was a struggle for him so for me i had said that anywhere is better than not playing football and a lot of people said oh the standard of the player is super high and this i said anywhere um if you're a baller you go anywhere do your thing and then move on all right so we want to let you know um that we got some information right here that he is going to be signing for the switchbox fc all right so they said welcome to the team Tariq. everyone please welcome Tariq mcgee um to the switchbox for 2023 so obviously as soon as the contract contract ends he's going to be there let me go on the switchback um colorado springs if you want to search for them all right so colorado springs switchback fc usl championship the second tier in England all right and in in the league for seven years so obviously they are developing French franchise then all right market value at this point if you want to know more about the club um 4.2 uh, million and obviously him coming in with maybe 150 upwards it might top it up a notch you have a few personals there that he might have conversation with you saw Devon of Speedy Williams right there Malik Foster and Deshane Beckford with Romario Williams so it's a load of Jamaicans there so maybe this is something where that he could feel a little bit better in Belgium you're not going to feel better if you are just you're coming from directly Jamaica it's going to be extremely hard for you to fit in those places so I could see the challenges for Tyreek Maggie so for me I think it's a good move for him all right yes because of the condition at the time so and i've said this two years running that i would have actually sent him to the usl because i saw the difference so that's why i said so and now you can show your talent once you go on the field and then people can pick you up you have persons leave from the mls go on to have top level in their career so this is just a stepping stone move from here to the mls and then you can go back into europe with much more um, luxury right there for you that's just my take what say you all right i give it a pass mark in terms of what's up all right so let me know what say you peace out